Welcome to this video. In this video, we will try to predict whether Vladimir Putin will decide to use a nuclear bomb. Using Vedic astrology, we will try to find out in the next few minutes. So, please watch the full video. If you have not subscribed to the channel yet, please subscribe to the channel by pressing the subscribe button and the bell button below. This channel will be useful to you. You can learn Vedic Astrology and Remedies by subscribing. Before I start the topic, I am very happy to inform you that my prediction about the Uttar Pradesh election result has come true. You can find that video through the link given in the description below or you can visit through the link given above at the top of the screen. Now let's talk about the war. Few days back, I posted a video in which I predicted about the duration of the Russian-Ukraine war. If you have not watched that video, you can see it through the link given in the description below. You can also visit through the link at the top of the screen. You can also watch another video about the general predictions for the year 2022. You can watch it through another link in the description below. You will also find that link on the top of the screen right now. In both of these videos, I have explained about the planetary combinations which are causing this war to break out. One question that is lingering in many people's mind is Will Russia use nuclear weapons in this war? And will Putin authorize the use of nuclear weapons? This question also arose in my mind on 1st March 2022. It was near midnight and the time was 23.47 pm. The location was in Chennai, in the southern part of India. I had to use Javakul Prashna because the conventional prashna was a little bit unclear. Here, the Arudam Lord is debilitated. Even though the Udayam Lord is in 9th house in the outer chart, it is in 8th house in the transit chart. What I am concluding is, even though Russia is keeping all its options open, the countries on the other side will take care not to provoke Russia further. What I feel is, Russian government is feeling threatened and is ready to fight to the death. The Russian government is open to both peace talks as well as total destruction. The real danger period is during the end of March and the first half of April. And that danger is because of the Sangarsha Yoga caused by a strong Saturn and a strong Mars. My personal wish is that the concerned leaders should exercise restraint, especially during this danger period. There are high casualties on both sides. It's really painful. I request everyone to pray for the war to stop. Prayers are very powerful. Prayers have helped many people who are in distress. With a very heavy heart, I request all of you to pray for the peace to prevail. If you have any questions or feedback, please comment below. If you really like this video, please press the like button. Whenever you press the like button, it encourages me to share more and more useful information. If you are not subscribed to this channel yet, please subscribe to the channel by pressing the subscribe button and the bell button below. Only when you press the notification button, you will be able to get the notifications for my future videos. This channel will be useful to you.